everyone and welcome back to the dog and party to play some fire name craft tales if you haven't met before this is my very small very flat extremely <laughs> short brother hi everyone can you say me as you know we're in strange times and uh so we've had to do a kind of a video link kind of a setup uh we're not very technically minded uh so this is about the best we can do Earlier on today. I'm not. <laughs> Say again. I said you're not, but I am. Yeah. Early on today, I went to shops, dropped some beer, bro, some beer around me, didn't I, bro? You didn't do, bro. Yeah, and uh, the first one we're <laughs> going to get, the first one we're going to do is liquid summer gold. Oh yes, indeed. Now Where's it from, bro? It's from Dark Rock Brewing, and you may remember it's the one I kind of messed up on. Oh, you did. Good time. And they very kindly be sent me uh, a new kit, and I got the kit on the go straight away. Right, yeah. Thank you, Doki. So, you got yours? I've got mine here. Cheers. Right, Cheers. Does it look, at first, instantly, it looks ten times, thousand times better than it did do before. Oh. Got straight in, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> and taste. Oh, that's not and tastes absolutely superb. Alright, brilliant. Nice golden yeah, refreshing. Say. Yes, go on. Nice gold colour, like you say. Nice refreshing. It does what it says on the can, doesn't it? It's it liquid is. gold, mate. Yes, liquid sun and gold. It does what it says on the can. Mm. Mm. Ten times better than it was before. That's fantastic. That's fantastic, that is. Just goes to show what you can do and what you can't do when you mess up your brewing. <laughs> It's straight in with a 10 out of 10 for me. Train, ten out of 10. Talking about brewing, bro. Yes. Did you know there's been an explosion in people doing home brewing? There's been an explosion. I'm not surprised there's been an explosion in home brewing. Nobody can get in and the fuck, can they? Nobody can get any out to do anything, so I think a lot of people have decided to start home brewing. Uh, of course, if you are starting brewing, don't forget about our... Uh, our list down here. I'll just oh. show that to everybody there. It's a 12 pints of... Sorry again? You got the list out? Got the list out. It's our 12 it's right. pints it's of right. liquid. Yeah, but he's not technology mine enough, so I can't see what's going on. <laughs> I've just got the list out, bro. I'm just showing it to the camera. Okay? There's not a bad okay. kit. Not a bad kit on this list, is there? Now, if you are starting out, uh, I would suggest you start with kits. Probably a Mumton's um, Continental Pilsner or the or the Wherry, and then work your way up and uh, to Park Lane, really. But I think a lot of people have gone straight in and bought um, the Grandfather, which is an all-in-one uh, brewing kit. Uh, do remember, it's going to take about four hours to do um, an all-grain kit. Which means you've got quite a bit of time on your hands in a minute, but if things ever do turn back to normal, you might always have four hours on your hands. Isn't that right, bro? Yeah, that's right, bro. That's right. You're right, you're not falling out, are you? No, I've just put the 12 beer kits of partridge down. And right. uh, shall we do another beer? What other beer are we doing, bro? Simcoe. Simcoe? Where's mm. it from? Uh, Mangrove Jacks. I'm just going to show the people at home the, the bag, the brewery pouch bag. And, I'll I'll show, do it. and uh, on here, it does say it comes out approximately 5.6%. That, that's if you add uh, 1.2 G's of liquid extract. Well, you didn't have 1.2 G's kicking around, so I'll put 1.275 in. 1.75, should I say. Okay, okay. <laughs> Which makes it slightly stronger than 5.6. So you're probably still getting about uh, 6, 6.5. Six still there? I'm still there. I've just put the I've just oh. put the brewery patch down. I'm just picking up my beer. I've got one ready, mate. Oh yeah. Now what's it smell like then, bro? Um, it, it's, um, it's got quite a punchy nose, hasn't it? Yeah, it's got quite a punchy nose from that single op. So the, the, it does come with dry ops. And you uh, put the, put those in there, and uh, away you go. Oh, I'm going in. Cheers. Going in. Cheers. Oh ho! Ho ho! That's got a bit. 
It's a bit of a kick, isn't it? Isn't it, eh? That's quite oh, nice. Oh. I quite like that. Ah, that's fab, that. I don't know how to drink that falling over. Because obviously I see it's 5.6% oh. and it's going to make it now slightly more. That's got straight to my cheekbones, hasn't it? Ah, it has, not it? And it's got a good hot punch there, though, from the Simcoe, hasn't it? So, uh, that's fantastic. Like you say, it's nice and punchy. Nice I punchy. imagine that's very strong. Yes, yes. 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 <laughs> uh, it was a mangrove jacks, you said, didn't you? Mangrove jacks. In one of them brewery packs. Near pouch Yeah, so you spit it open, you've got yeast and uh, ops one side and instructions and malt extract the other side. Lovely jubbly. Lovely jubbly. I think that's about that's it today, don't they? Oh, well, oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> I reckon that's a 10 out of 10 for me. I think it's 10 out of 10. So, I don't think I've bought too many of them, though. No, not too many of them. Just like, uh, probably, yeah. Mm. Mm. Yeah. So that's two 10 out of 10 beers, then, bro. That's two beers. Are we doing another beer or not? No, we ain't got no more beer today. That's just it today, because I've got one of my old favourite... You, you brought me another beer, and I thought it was... I thought it was another one today. No, no, just, just supplies, that is. For your general consumption. It's nice, anyway. On the other pump, you see, bro, at the moment, I've got um, uh, Mangrove Jack's Juicy juicy um, Session Ale, which we've already done a review okay. of, and it's on our 12 points of Christmas list. Ah, right, okay, yeah. Right, yeah. So that's about it for today. I mean, the next time we do a video, oh, this is <laughs> if things are back to normal, because I don't know if we can cope right this again, do you, bro? <laughs> I, I think we might have to do another one like this. I don't think it's, it's going to end any time soon, bro. Oh, yeah. Even if you, even if we relax, people going around to people's houses, you could stand at one end of the bar, and I'll put the thing on wide focus. <laughs> I mean, yeah, could, could, yeah. Yeah. Or even maybe a special edition from your garden. We could do a special edition from the garden, the beer garden, of course. Yeah. Well, if you are brewing people, please keep safe. Please uh, try and abide by the guidelines. But I'm just open and praying that everybody keeps safe. And if you are starting brewing, yeah, all the best to you. If you're thinking, of, if you are a brewer and you, you carry on brewing, stay safe, carry on brewing, people, and we'll see you again soon back from the Dungan Partridge. Until next time, it's goodbye from him. It's goodbye from him. See you, Drew. See you,